dome is up, and we're going to take you inside and show you how it was done on this episode of We're Going In. We got here about 6.30 this morning before the sun was even up and in less than 30 minutes the dome top was already inflated. Then in two hours we went from flat to this, flat to full in two hours. That's that, I think better than anybody anticipated or anybody thought would, would happen. It took four large blowers to inflate the structure. One is running on grid power and the other three are running on generator power. That way if the city loses power the dome will stay inflated. These blowers will run 24-7 until the concrete work on the inside is complete in about 60 days. I was one of the first invited to enter the new dome and Nathan South, co-owner of South Industries, took me for a tour. Today we inflated the Hennessy Gymnasium. Um, it kind of was in two stages. The, the dome is the gray fabric that you can see and then the stem wall is the white fabric that you can see. The white outer steel ring at the top of the walls weighs 15 tons. So once the dome was inflated, it began to lift that ring in the air until it was at full height, and that's what we see here. Saved us quite a bit of money up front, the way we've done it. And then secondly, the time, it cut a full month off the, the length of time it takes to put something like this up. That is the beauty about this system, right? Is instead of having to build a wall prior and then put the dome on top, and it took about 45 minutes for us to inflate an entire structure that keeps all the elements out. Uh, just when we needed the facility anyway, I didn't see a better way to, to, to complete it than with this type of a structure. So, what's next? The, the big part of the work that's left to do on the dome itself uh, starts, uh, again, as soon as tomorrow possibly, where they start spraying on the foam insulation. And once the, the, the uh, outside of the structure is where it is right now and it's the pressure, it can withstand wind, uh, snow, rain, ice, all of that. So everybody will be working inside for the next anywhere from six to nine weeks. It went great. I feel great. I feel pretty blessed that it went as smoothly as it did. So much of what we do just as humans, right, is dependent on weather and the conditions and they were perfect today. Calm. Um, it went about as good as could be expected. I feel really good about this morning. Although the biggest part of the structure is now up, it is only the beginning of the work to be done to bring this new facility to life for the Hennessy community. We will be here every step of the way bringing you regular updates. I'm Jack Quirk, and I thank you for watching this episode of We're Going In.